So here's a small video of some uh, of these blank tapes I've managed to come across over the years since, you know, cassettes are pretty much not a thing, but at the same time as I'm doing this video, you never know, I think there are some places that it might consider doing a, some sort of comeback, but you know what, I'm not going to get too ahead on that subject because I don't know. But um, yeah, this is some of the tapes I've come across at like Goodwills or thrift stores or even the local music uh, record store that I go to. So I'm just going to quickly, um, these are all sealed, they're not opened. I'm just going to go quickly show we got a Sony CD It. It's a purple cassette. And I got most of these for like a buck or two, so that's pretty sweet. Then we have this Scotch BX90. And then a Sony UX 100 minutes. Best for CD. This one's actually starting to rip open. I you can see the purple purple infrared sensor on my phone. That's funny. A Memorex 90 minute. I believe this tape is from the 80s. Another Memorex. This is a 60 minute. Oh yeah, you definitely can see the infrared, that's kind of funny. A Sony CD It Type 2, 100 minute. With the ultra slim case. This one's starting to open up too. A TDK SA 100 minute. Oh, there you go. Look, I paid a buck for that. Memorex DBS 60. And if you're wondering what this cassette actually looks like, here's one that's opened. It's a 120 minute, but it's the same exact look. So this is what this cassette would look like. A Sony HF60. Made in Mexico. Did I show the back on this one? I don't know if I showed the back on this one. The Memorex one. I don't recall doing that. Look at Boombox, Walkmans, and Cars. <laughs> God, that's funny. A BASF. A Faro Extra 90. A TDK SD 110 Type 2. Well, that two bucks. And I got two of these Memorex CD2 110s, high bias. Best to use with home stereos. And then I got a nice f f six pack here of Fuji. Extra slim case. And I got a five pack of Sony HF 90s. And an eight pack of Maxell UR 60s. This I got at Goodwill for friggin' two bucks. Someone actually donated an unopened pack of t cassettes to Goodwill. I find that funny.
And this isn't really a big thing, but uh, these are all the uh, cheapo Walmart tapes I've bought over the last couple weeks. And you all know what these cheap ones look like. There's nothing on the case except, except A and B. So yeah, there's all the cassettes uh, I have acquired over the last year or two. And I still hope to find more in the near future. Later.